Yarato, Yarato. Daiz Nish and Daiz Nishik. Friday, Friday after work. I thought that I need to cut my hair here. I saw it, yeah. DJ Yatit at the Hoyos Kasse. Friday afternoon, 3 34. I got out early. Ah, do. Chadet as oit on. Now they let this sneak it. Date night? You should all yes, it's this, son. What is that? <laughs> She's playing her solitary. I saw not. Yeah. When we met, we only went to what? Two concerts? We only, 35 years ago. We only <laughs> went to two concerts. And the first one was like 35 years ago when George Strait. No, it was Earl Thomas Conley. Oh, it was Earl Thomas Conley at the Tuba City Community Center. That's like 39 years ago. Oh. And then about, she, 88, 92, 94, though, because Andrea was two. Mm -hmm. 1994, somewhere around there, we went to a George Street concert in ASU Stadium. I don't, I don't know, seven years ago, what do you think, about eight years ago, we went and watched um, Billy Ray Cyrus at the Celebrity Theater, she tossed down on like 32nd Street and uh, Van Burns, Washington, somewhere over but tonight, yeah, yeah, Prescott Valley. Go there, We're going to Prescott Valley. In, uh, we bought those tickets a long time ago. We bought the tickets way, like, back in October, November? Yeah. Oh, in October, November of last year, we bought these tickets, and we're going to go watch uh, Cody Johnson you know, at the uh, Toyota, Toyota Finley. Prescott Valley, eight eight seven thirty. What you know? What it? What it? We actually wanted to watch uh, Cody Johnson at Mandalay Bay mm -hmm. in Las Vegas, and we couldn't make it, so we decided just to push it out to April here in Prescott Valley. So, oh, what it? So that's what we're doing, and Otto yesterday. Oh, this big horn is giving us trouble. Yes, yesterday or uh, yes, are you getting back on the bus? Oh, okay. yeah, we're picking you up. We're on oh, our way. Yesterday, Bighorn Hi. gave us trouble again. Uh, my ra our radiator had a, a big leak on the driver's side, all the sideways. So we had to have that fixed, and it cost us a uh, bunch of change. So we're gonna test out this new. Uh, Radiator. Well, we're gonna go to Prescott Valley. So, so we want it. Ash, we'll show a little bit of it. We're not gonna show all of it. So, we're gonna do that tonight, and we shall check it out. So, we're picking up our granddaughter at the school, and uh, we not here at each other. Drop her back at the house, and we'll go ahead and uh, head on home. Drop them off, and I'll throw my clothes in the truck. We'll throw our clothes in the truck and we'll take off. So we'll probably eat something in Prescott Valley or something. So we'll see what happens. Hey, look. See you on the road, Jenna. This is how our date is going right now. We're eating chicken. We're having KFC. We're going to a concert. We're going to go eat at um, Olive Garden in Prescott. But I think we don't have enough time. It is already 6.30 and it starts at 7, so I don't think we have time. So we decided to stop at KFC. I said, let's go in there early and go look around for some shirt, but it's not. <laughs> she was all happy. <laughs> Might have buy a couple shirt or I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. So this is what our our date dinner is. Part mm -hmm. in front of KSC. 
we just went through the drive through and I got me a uh, four piece chicken. You see, the woman got a two piece chicken with mashed potato and uh, iced tea. On a Sunday, uh, mashed potato with uh, Diet Pepsi and so Yeah, we're just we're just here eating, getting ready to go check out the concert. And the Cody Johnson. If we would have known that he was going to be a country thunder, we're just talking about him. If we would have known that he was going to be a country thunder, what is going on? Way in South Side, on the other side of Phoenix. We could have just spent the 80 bucks per person and be there all day tomorrow. Dude. No, yeah. Because Cody Johnson's going to be over there tomorrow, too. So, But we didn't know. So That tells you how much we know about concerts. So, so we're just going to hack it out here and uh, see you. Uh, See what's going to happen after the concert. We might have to run home. Or find a place to stay, probably. I don't know. We'll see. Let's go eat so my son has a peso. It's like a hot Ten dollars in the town. Concert or that? Kahar shahat no. Waylon Jennings to. Gary Stewart to. Kailan na? Don Williams. Nikki Yenta Field House. Never nothing to all. To all. So my son is a co. That's a mama's story. That's her story. Kedasha, <laughs> you guys ever remember the yellow front commercial? Yellow front, eh, yeah. <laughs> oh yellow front remember everybody remember the yellow front mm. we're gonna go check out this concert see what's happening after we eat we're gonna drive over there just around the corner yeah, check out Cody Johnson. He sings real good. Mm hmm. It's on the one. The Abbasol machine. What's up? What's up? Cody Johnson was the Chiefly song. He was a. He a, was a, uh, a rodeo participant? Yeah. He's like a bull rider turned into a country singer. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. I think he was a bareback man. Think so? Mm -hmm. I don't know. But he was in the rodeo. <clears throat> chicken eat chicken eat though. Mm. Concert the Yahid KFC honey chindole. Chicken. <laughs> Chicken honey chindole. Everybody probably just be looking at us all somehow. Damn, that guy had KFC. He got to the thorny. We're eating here still. It is 6.45. Tell you how I don't need. Sunny or chon, a ho hail, I say, yash old here. Say, what do you want? I want two legs and two breasts in me. 
two the thighs. two thighs and two breast Indian that the wife got mad at me. <laughs> mm, the nun, eh, the nun. No, I want chicken. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, we're just we're just having fun, making jokes, making our trip the best of it. So it's kind of nice to be going out here together and go to this concert and see what it's all about so Ella. next one is K-E-T a long line is there another line over there let's go to that line over there huh yeah, it is. Come on. Last time, how, how many people said you were here for the very first time watching me live? I want you to know that you're the reason I recorded the human music video the way I did. The reason I did that is because I wanted to introduce myself to you. When you see that video, Dustin came out for two weeks, they followed me around for six shows, and he's like, Man, what if we came to your ranch? And we followed you around while you weren't cows and do stuff. And I was like, this is an awful idea. This is horrible. Cameras on me, but then you know what? I thought about you. And I thought, there's a lot of people out there that don't really know me. You might have heard my songs on the radio. You might have seen me on TV, but you don't know who I am. So allow me to introduce myself. Hi, I'm Cody. And when you watch the human music video, I want you to know that that's really me. Those horses and cows, the, the, my gorgeous wife and my two beautiful little girls at home. That's, that's real life for me. And when you hear this song on the radio, by the way, it's in the top ten. If you feel like requesting it on your local radio station, we won't be mad at you. That's called shameless self-promotion right there. When you hear this song, I want you to know that I've lived this song, and I think I can speak for a few of the guys in the band whenever we say, uh, we really love this one, man. And, and this is the thing. I don't care what color you are. I don't care what, where you're from. I don't care how much money you make. At the end of the day, you put us all in this big old boiling pot called America, and you turn the fire on, and we're all the same. I think that's something we should all remember. Today, I was at meet and greet, 
and a, 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 a man or a woman asked me, they said, is it weird for people to get nervous to meet you? And I said, yeah, it is. It's absolutely weird because I, I, I wake up and put on pants just like everybody else. We're all human. And I, I realized, you know, without, without trying to plug my song, I had said something that I sing every night. So I hope this song speaks to you the way it speaks to me. This is called You. Special invitation, Jim. This is our grandson's photo. Hello. 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 <laughs> Let's see what the boss says. <laughs> what the heck? No, no. Mm -hmm. Formal, say like a dress shirt. Yeah, nothing, nothing too fancy. So if you yeah, wanna... we're talking about. What does that mean? You know, graduation clothes. <laughs> oh. Remember that shirt you bought? That shirt that I bought. Is that okay? The ten cent shirt that I bought. <laughs> a western shirt. Your Stetson hat. Yeah. There you go. See? What is that? Oh. Read it. It's like a. You ever seen the Oscars? See, I'm like the trophies you get and stuff? Yeah, see, look, I'm going to be wearing this look. And then here's Grandma. Oh, like a YouTube gathering? Uh -huh. That's me. Is it like a... Is it like an actual like YouTube thing or just like a... Hi, how are you? Good, 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 good. I don't know, you ready? Chicken fried rice. Okay. Okay. You want the teriyaki chicken? Uh, a la carte. Do you have a chicken a la carte? Okay. Uh, teriyaki chicken is fine. Teriyaki chicken. The lunch Yeah, teriyaki chicken. Okay. What are those chilies? Oh, the red chili. And then the hot chili, the red okay. chili. Okay. Think that chicken chop suey. Okay. Does that have shrimp on there? You want to get shrimp? No, oh, chicken. no, I'm uh, chicken. I was just asking chicken. if it has. Okay, shrimp on okay. Meat. Okay, chicken chop suey. The lunch, tiago chicken, and the dinner, tiago chicken, and chicken fried rice. Ah, I see. And the hot chili on the side. Yes. Okay. Any else? Uh, what? What's neat about this, this looks like our tablecloth, huh, Mom? Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. <laughs> it does look good. That is a water dish. Yeah. And I think it was like, come out like that. Like, you know, we'll get the... Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Dang. That's 
gonna eat all that? Not a lot of food here. Ooh. A lot of food. This is Navajo Urban Dish Chini here on Sunday morning, April the 16th. Aro e ya neto nen shinge dish chini. Dish chini shlung o tapa hapa se shin. Sena chini ta shin neliko mai dish kizni e ta shi chi. Aro tapas e ya tachi ni no lokai da shin. Tapa tapa neliko tapa tapa chi. Of Nenny Gnoia YouTube Navajo Urban Dish Cheating Audio. That's what we're, our, we name ourselves because uh, we're urbans and we're Navajos and we're from the Res. We live down here in the Phoenix area for uh, close to 40 years now, so and uh, we're about ready to go back. And so we're about ready here in a couple, ho hopefully, a couple of years we'll head back. So Move back to the uh, res where we built our uh, house and live uh, the real the real res life. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Brandon. <laughs> so, Ella, hey, yeah, hey, yeah. I just wanted to say something uh, about myself. I started this YouTube YouTube channel uh, January first of 2020, and my first vlog was with uh, my little puppy Max. And uh, it was rolling out of the carport. And uh, we're listening to Whitney Houston, and uh, I will always love you. And you said you should thought part and get lost. Well, that was my first channel. Hi, New Year in the 2020. Take a shot at this puppy vlogging, Jenna. But okay. Well, we're gonna take a cruise. Back in 2019, Tupa City Fair, Western Navajo Agency Fair. We're over there selling our um, our normal traditional clothes that Susie makes in our aprons. And uh, we ran into uh, Manuel Jeanne from uh, originally from Yai Team. It was kind of cool to meet them, meet him, and I met him, and my wife met him, and my granddaughter uh, Raylene met him too, so it uh, kind of uh, motivated me to do something like this. So, and then at the same time, uh, I saw um, MBN, MBN, BZB, Mike, Michael Balasaris and his family. He came up to our booth and he was just resting because I know that he was a native YouTuber. But uh, at that time, he said that his batteries was out. So that's why he wasn't YouTubing at that time. So there's only two that I met at the Tupac City Navajo Nation Affair at that time. And uh, me and my wife, we watch... Uh, Natalie Franklin all the time from way back then and uh, Daybreak Warrior. So Daybreak Warrior is a guy I like because he speaks a lot of Navajo language. And I know I speak Navajo, but there's a lot more to learn from Daybreak Warrior. So those are the four that really motivated me to uh, keep on going. And uh, and back then, um, Yo Boy Norm was on too, so I watched him too. So that was kind of cool. So... That phone motivated me. So at this time right now, like uh, three years, I think it is. I am at, I think I'm sitting at like uh, 33,367. 3, I think that's where I'm sitting at as a subscriber. So, which is kind of cool. Started off with one and getting up to 3,363, uh, 67. I think that's something new and exciting to enjoy so hey, yeah, yesterday uh mr ryan called me and uh, if i had time to meet him so i invited him to meet meet us at big hang our famous little restaurant if you ever go to big hang here in peoria 
there's uh, always good food, a lot of food, for a le real less uh, cheaper price, I think. So it's up to you guys. You guys want to eat there and see what you guys think. So we like the food. So, And Mr. Ryan yet, he gave me an invitation, which is kind of neat, I think. And uh, getting something like this in... Uh, Getting something like this, I think, is cool. It was a, uh, oh, it was a, uh, a lanyard, a lanyard, a badge for me and the boss, Susie, my wife. And it says Navajo Urban Dish Cheat Me on there. It's kind of cool. And uh, I don't know if they thought about it, though, but every time we go to the flea market, when we sell this border right here, matches or tablecloth so it's kind of neat so it might be all the same like this i don't know or it might just be us sets like this i don't know we'll see we get to see other people's badges when we all get there so in jonich and nesso we got invited to attend that and i thought that was really cool we uh we uh we never we never went to the one meet and greet and uh in uh, Tempe, when uh, Jarrett's and Hostine and Jermonson hosted, we didn't go because uh, I had things to do. And uh, the one in Gallup, that too, we missed that one too. And uh, this one right here says, uh, we're rolling out the red carpet for native YouTuber, Gala, Friday, March, May the 12th, 2023 at 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. Star Conference Center, 2502 East Washington Street, Phoenix, Arizona, 85034. And then it says, semi-formal traditional attire of a castle. So we got invited to go over here and I think, I think it's kind of neat, something to experience because we've never been to a, be, a big meet and greet and there is a lot of people on there and uh, there's a lot of people on there and it will be exciting to meet them I think and uh, it is it is where um, all the uh, subscribers subscribers for every YouTube native YouTuber for subscribers to come and see other native YouTubers if you're subscribed to me, you come over there and see me, and but you get to see all the other native YouTubers. You might be subscribed to all of them though, but it will be nice for all a lot of subscribers to come out. And uh, I can't wait to meet a lot of subscribers. I only see their names and comments on my uh, channel, and uh, it will be nice to meet a lot of them face to face. So there'll probably be a lot of. Uh, pictures going on with other natives so i think that other native youtubers so i think that'll be really great for everybody to come together and uh, have some fun so and uh, we'll see what happens so i i really enjoyed uh i really enjoyed uh, i really enjoyed doing the youtube um i'm thankful for everybody that followed us and uh, through the flea market when i was building my house and my puppy life up on the red so it is good to uh, say thank you to all my subscribers, all the uh, 3,367 of you. I really appreciate that. So, for that being said, I wish uh, I get to see a lot of you subscribers out there. Not just only my subscriber, but all the other subscribers. All the other subscribers for all the native YouTubers. So, it should be fun. So, I'm really looking forward to it. May 12th, June. So, and uh, thanks, uh, we, uh, I'd like to thank Ryan for hosting all this together. I know it take a lot of time and money for him, so it is really nice for him to do this. So, and, uh, so uh, I shall, uh, hopefully I see a lot of people, a lot of subscribers at the uh, meet and greet for Mr. Ryan's uh, Roll Out the Carpet. And, so, and, uh, thank you for uh, watching my channel. I really appreciate that. If you uh, haven't subscribed yet, please do. I know a lot of native natives, they haven't subscribed yet because they don't have 
internet or for what reason but they like you watching the youtube channel but what that is good too so i always tell them say you watching our channels all our channels and all the other channels makes us happy and if you if you can't subscribe that's fine with me too so, so that is uh as of that i shall see you me and susie the boss we would really like to appreciate it and see you at the gathering of the uh, Native YouTubers downtown at the Star Conference Center. And I can't wait, so I hope you guys all show up. I really appreciate that. And um, can't wait to see all the other Native YouTubers too. It is exciting, so I shall see you guys all over there. Thank you, thank you, thank you.